So, so what I found out with better throws, you can pick your starting point, think about where you're going, and go that way. And, and if you're if you change it here, yeah. yeah. And so and so so now we've got here so it starts and here and from. here. Then at the end, I could add a little bit of wrist. Now it's a little bit more angular. And then the last little bit, which is what the guy was showing, is that right up in here, you finish with an explosive pec flex. Like that. Goes, goes right across the chest. And, and, and you do that against the inertia of your paddle. Like that. And you make a noise like Monica Shellish on a backhand. Oh yeah, 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 and 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 that, then that, that's that's as as much as you can get, and then the the, the angle has to be what it is to get it. Now, what Bob Keelan told me about hitting things was the way you hit stuff is you look at the target, you look at the target, and you throw, and then it hits it. Not the first time, <laughs> but eventually throwing, and in the early innings of uh, uh, Paolo's wedding, you've got this little tiny kid who gets uh, over. Um, he sits in his little toy kayak and throws this little harpoon, and it, and Wow, it's a line drive. It's like, wow, that's really good. And so the little kids start at three, and they throw, and the hunters, when they go out, as they're trying to hunt the ground, they'll say a piece of seaweed, and they'll pick it up and practice throw. And by training, your movement to looking at the target, you know, you get all that relationship built into this wonderful dynamic processor, and you can hit stuff. <laughs> <laughs> pushing this way, we're, 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 we're.